Welcome back, welcome back to another episode of HGV Talks. Uh, my podcast where I pretty much sit here and just ramble for like 15 minutes and I never know what I'm about to say or what not. And yeah, let's do another one. I have a comment. Oh, this was from six months ago. Wow. Cool. Um, That's fun. I was going to pull up the YouTube comments, but I was like, let me pull up my uh Spotify in my anchor, whatever it is, because this podcast does go on Spotify and I think, I think it goes a lot of places. I don't think it uploads to like just Spotify and YouTube. I think it goes to like a bunch of different things like Apple and whatnot, but I don't know. Um, so the last podcast, I don't remember exactly what I was talking about. I said on the struggle bus. That was my thing. I think it was just like, it's just been a busy busy time frame and whatnot like usual uh, i was talking about what i was going to play next um i'm looking at the comments i seen pi said you know i could always do perg oh wait rip perg rad red nuzlocke uh drinking is a camping pastime of choice oh we were talking about camping and stuff yeah, yeah, yeah. like what we do during camping yeah um yeah so i haven't started the new playthrough yet that's kind of where I guess I should start. Uh, the Yellow Legacy series ended. Just trying to, I am, I'm really tired right now. I haven't drank my coffee yet. But Yellow Legacy ended. I got absolutely molly whopped by a rival battle, and I. The next one I'm gonna do is. <clears throat> I'm gonna do an Ultra Sun or Ultra Moon randomized Nuzlocke. I just haven't done one of those in so long. I was looking at it, like looking at my page, and the I mean I did a randomized Nuzlocke of the Emerald National decks, but that's like a ROM hack, you know. And then I did Radical Red Nuzlocke before that, Soul Link, and what else? Moon Black 2, which was just a regular playthrough, which I did like that game a lot. And then before that was, I'm already going back. We're already in 2023 right now. The Pokemon White Breeze Lock was the last one I did, and that was eight months ago. And did we win that one? I don't think I did. I think we lost. Yeah, we did. Yeah, uh, Kyogre. Kyogre beat me. I was in the Elite Four. So that one was the last randomized Nuzlocke I did, and that was a Breeze Lock. Uh, that was on in November. So it's, it's almost August of 2024 since the last time I did a randomized Nuzlocke. And the that Breeze Locks had the move sets that were different had better movesets, which is a different setting that I didn't use to run. Like, I never used to run that. I started running that for the Breeze Lock specifically to add more difficulty to it, and they were super, super difficult. Um, I could do a Breeze Lock of Ultra Moon. I really don't know if I want to do that, though. But yeah, so... I'm trying to, I'm still scrolling. Infinite Fusions was before that. Soul Link, Breeze Lock. Man, the, my only thing with that better movesets thing, it doesn't always make the game, it doesn't always make Pokemon better or more challenging. It just, it's just stuff you don't know. You don't know what's going to happen. So, I don't know. I'm I'm really torn on if I should breeze lock and do that better move set setting or if I should just randomize Nuzlocke, Sun and Moon. Cause sometimes, like I said, sometimes with the better move sets, this aren't Pokemon, that'd be great, and then they, they give it a better move set and it ends up being useless. It'll have no attacks or something like that. So it's like I kinda got over that setting. So I think I'm gonna I think I'm gonna try doing it differently. Try doing it differently. The last playthrough I did that was a randomized it was my iron mon I was doing which you know the only six mons 
for the team and if you catch pokemon it has to join the team and replace something like there's no box mons that's the last time i did ultra moon and that was over a year ago that was it was the very beginning of 2023 end of 2022 probably so i think i'm just gonna go back to a regular standard randomized nuzlocke i haven't done one in a long time uh so i don't know we'll see i think that's i think that's what it's gonna be i'm looking at all my different th like stream titles for my uh podcast episodes and it's just it's funny it's like constant we're back we're on a good roll we're you know doing good with the gym and then it's like we're not doing good we had a bad week we're too busy then it's like we're doing good we're <laughs> it's just constant the ebb and flow of my life uh yeah man that's just kind of what i like about this podcast i mean i guess it's you know during the streams and during the youtube videos i don't really want to spend too much time talking about like personal thing not personal things but like dude my beard was freaking insane wait why didn't i play the video what the, i'm gonna show this real quick what the hell my why do i not remember my beard being that long wow Holy crap. That's insane. I don't remember it being that long. Yikes. Wow. Damn. Sounds wrong with me. Um, but yeah. Uh, yeah, I don't like to I try to keep the streams and the YouTube videos. Sorry, I'm off track again. That's all this podcast is. is me getting distracted and bouncing around topics. Uh, but I like to try to keep, you know the stream and whatnot a little more laid back and just shits and giggles and fucking around nothing serious uh it's been kind of obviously with a lot of stuff that's been happening over the past couple weeks you know with uh my uh mods and stuff changing in the discord and all that and you know and personalities you gotta manage you know it's 90 percent of my job is just managing people and personalities but um it's been pretty good in stream so i'm happy about that uh things happen here and there it's been a lot more like off stream and discord and dms that i've been dealing with a lot more nonsense and stuff that i wish i didn't have to deal with but it's part of the job um but i think things are gonna be fine i Definitely have been having more, like, I try to be careful the way I say things, but I've been having, like, more of an understanding as to why people don't want to be full-time content creators <laughs> and, like, why a lot of people aren't as involved in their own communities as I think that I am. Most people, most larger content creators I feel like are they separate themselves more and I feel like I'm getting that more and understanding that more and um I just feel like I don't want to get too far from what I've been doing <sighs> but it's not always easy man uh I feel like I just got a, I feel like I got a good thing going. I feel like I got a, maybe make a pivot to something, figure something out. But, you know, there's some stuff that's inevitable. I just got to work through it, man. Um, the YouTube's been doing good, though. I really, like I said, I wish the YouTube and Facebook, like it's, it's, it's on the cusp of, being much better but it's like i need i need to do something about you know i don't know it's like i need a i love let's plays and i love the way i do my content and i love the way it's been forever but it's like it's just been the same thing for so long and the same growth and the same 
everything for so so long that I'm like I feel like I need to do something I need to spice it up and do something different to like just get me out of this rut that I feel like I'm in you know it's feeling like I'm just walking in circles sometimes and I feel like I'm just as close to being unable to do this full time as I was the day I started doing it even though I know it's not true but it's the feeling you know so gotta figure something out but aside from that like I said I'm it's literally like 7 a.m. right now I've been up since like 3 o'clock in the morning losing sleep over things that I shouldn't be having to lose sleep over but uh, I'm gonna try having a good Sunday Try to get some stuff done. Be productive. I'm probably going to stream today. I'm going to get a lot of recording and uploading done. And... Yeah, I don't know. It's kind of a blah podcast episode. Not that they're usually super riveting or anything, but... I guess we're going to wrap it up there. Um, I don't even know what kind of comments Steven asked for. If you got any comments or things you want to ask me about or things you want me to talk about feel free to let me know i try to check the youtube comments every time i know there's a couple of you guys that usually watch these every single week um so yeah if you guys got anything you want to hear me talk about or whatever let me know leave it there and i'll see you in the next one peace out